In the heavenly armor we'll enter the land. The battle belongs to the Lord. No weapon that's fashioned against us can stand. The battle belongs to the Lord. Hello, my dear family and friends. It's so true. The battle belongs to the Lord. Amen. Amen. The image behind me today is of a person in full armor. Charge. The helmet of salvation, breastplate of righteousness, girding himself with the truth. Praise be to God that we have the full armor of God. God gave us this tool. We need to use it. Do you have the full armor of God on today? If not, look up Ephesians 6, 10 through 18 and put on the armor of God. If you would like an easy prayer that puts on the armor of God from head to toe, let me know. Email me. You got my email. Email me and I will send it to you. It's a nice, beautiful prayer from head to toe. Okay, let's go ahead and get started with Joel and Victoria. The scripture is 1 Timothy 6.12 from NIV. Fight the good fight of faith. Take hold of the eternal life to which you were called when you made your good confession in the presence of my witnesses. The title of this devotional is The Good Fight. Some of the difficulties we complain about, the challenges we don't like, are meant to prepare us for greater favor, greater influence, greater opportunities. Quit telling yourself, it's too hard. They did me wrong. I can't put up with this. Instead of trying to pray away all the things that make you uncomfortable, pray away the people who get on your nerves pray the delays, try a different approach and say, God, help me to keep a good attitude in the midst of these challenges. Help me to stay in faith when people aren't treating me right. Help me to fight the good fight of faith and resist the temptation to compromise, to take the easy way out so that my character can develop, and I can handle what you have in store for me. You can handle every difficult situation through Christ. You have been armed with strength for battle. Dig your heels in and stand strong in your faith. Keep a song of praise. Keep being your best. You have the grace you need in every situation. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, thank you. Thank you so much for the abundance of grace that you give to us through every difficult and challenging situation we face. Father, we ask that you would help us to fight the good fight through Jesus Christ, who strengthened us to overcome what has overcome us. We will stay in faith and be our best as we abide in you and you abide in us. Empower us, Father. Give us what we need each and every day, each and every second of our lives so that we can conquer what is before us. We love you so much. We thank you for your awesomeness, God. We thank you for Jesus Christ. We thank you for Holy Spirit. We embrace you, our loving Father, our brother Jesus Christ, and our Holy Spirit, who guides and directs us each and every single day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We ask of all these things in your mighty and powerful name, God. Amen. 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 And amen. Until tomorrow. A la vida.